I think this is a very interesting default setup that I think we should try. I think it would have worked work really well against teams that like to aggress towards bathroom more and like to play up close. Especially if we if we throw a utility and we always know they like to play up close. It's going to be very, very good. Uh, you're going to see right now, you're going to see Jam. He's gonna, going to throw a front bathroom smoke from that staircase. And you're going to see another smoke divider once we get up. But we're going to see a 3 con rush here. Like being able to trade anything that happens. Jam is going to throw this divider smoke. The jam. Nope. It's gonna be the the uh, the monster hold player that's gonna throw the divider smoke. Here. Now what you're gonna see happen is these three players are going to clear together. Ellison, Ellison clears, right? Hold smoke. Now they're gonna phase the smoke. Now, what's really good about this? What I like about this is how they set up this phase. Right? They line up together and they know they're gonna phase smoke. What they're doing really is they're not they're not lining up, right? So if this player is here, he's peeking, right? He holds, and he's peeking, holding smoke. He's gonna get phased by three players. Now, if you're here, most likely three players are gonna kill you, or most likely even better is if this guy's here holding the smoke, and there's two players shooting at him the moment the smoke phases. It's a very good play. I think we should try phasing that smoke there, and having this default set up. Now. We're gonna look at jam or we're gonna look at our behold player and what they're doing. Really, it's very simple what they're doing, but it's very important too. Jam's gonna throw the smoke here. Immediately he's gonna come towards comes towards A main. Now he's not gonna have a smoke to to um, for for party here, but that doesn't matter. He's gonna wait it and his job really is only to see to see if they push fountain or if they go long. So come through. I was holding and now he's just holding long. Right, he's gonna check. And his, his only job is to hold long to see if any long push comes trying to do anything. And same thing with Drew. Right, the play right, the play that wants we want the fight. Alright, we want the fight here. This is what the play is right here. This is where we're gonna we're gonna make our fight. We're gonna win our fight if we do, if they're fighting there. And then we can work off depending on the rotates and what's happening. But at the end of the day, this guy's only holding monster. There's nothing much about it. Even if we look back, he throws the smoke. Throws a lineup smoke. Crazy lineup smoke for divider. Some shit like that. And flash bang. Order to flash over short. Just to make him think that we're going short. But bam. Just gonna hold. Hold the push. Hold any information. Any late lurks that they're trying to do timings. This is where we're going to focus our attention towards here. Now when we get here, it's just fast control. Let's see if we can force any fights. What uh, utility we have. You'll see three monitors coming through. A full take off the smoke. So really burst it I don't think that's a bad play whatsoever. Run it off of the default, but instead of fast exploding, just take fast false controls facing the smoke. And we have full bathrooms, and maybe we can we set off of uh, off of that depending on what uh what um what happens there.